Welcome to the F122 training video. Before you uh, actually begin running anything, make sure that you do consult the F122 setup instruction manual and you do install the software as instructed here on page seven and eight. So it has step-for-step -step, uh, software instructions, very simple, easy to do. Your software you will have received in an email. So just click on that link and then you can download the uh, program here. Now the F-122 has been in development for 15 years to get us to this point. It's a smaller device, but it's far more practical and flexible than any device in the world of frequency generators that's ever been produced. The output of this thing is amazing. We'll be demonstrating that later on. As far as the functionality, you have a power button here. We've already plugged in the device. There, of course, is a power cable in the back that's plugged into your outlet, so just you can turn on the power here. You have two settings, bulb or bath outputs. Right now it's set for bulb. These are your bulb outputs here. If you put, put it to bath, this is your, your bath output here. This is about 12 volts on bulb. We're looking at 1800 volts here. On the bath setting, of course, if you were set over here again, you would run the IM Pro Wave module, things like True Focus, True Silver, or any other releases that we may put out, which we have several others that would run from this uh, output here. But for now, let's set it back to bulb. You want to have a bulb plugged in whenever running the F122, and the reason is, is because there is 1800 volts coming from these terminals. And if there's no bulb plugged in, you actually start a program in this device, then arcing will occur here. You can blow a fuse or a transistor. Now we do have spares on the back if something happens by accident here, but we don't want that to happen. So make sure the bulb is plugged in. So I'm gonna do that right now. This is a spiral bulb. You may or may not own this device, but we're going to put this in the clips on the side and then we're going to take the red and black inputs and then we're going to put the black one here this is the ground side and this is the the hot side right here so it's that simple and uh, when you're running a ball program this light will light up it may pulse or it may glow steady depending on the program the same way if you're on the bath output if you plugged in an IM Pro wave here it would do the same thing. It may pulse, some programs will, or it may run steady. So uh, don't give us a call. Some people call us and say, oh, the machine is pulsing. Why is it doing that? Or it's, it's running steady. This is normal. Depends on the program that you're running. This is your ground hole here. Most of us will be getting a ground mat so that we would, we would put that behind our back or under our feet to give us greater acceleration. Uh, in this case, this is a color wand. It's an optional device. And if you should happen to own one of these, it would plug into the side of the, of the F-122 like this. And then you simply put this in this hole here and you have your grounding. Remember this. If the plug fits in the hole, it's the right plug. So the ground mat would have the same plug. You just put it in this hole here and off you go. You cannot plug something into the wrong hole. So you are safe. It's dumbed down for all of us so that we don't accidentally get confused and plug the ground into the IM Pro Wave hole or vice versa. That simply cannot be done with this design. So at this point, you can actually start running a program, but to do that, you have a USB cable. This would be plugged into your computer and it's plugged into the back of the F-117 as well. So at this time, we'll plug this into the computer and we'll actually demonstrate what a program looks like when it's running. So this is a standard program that comes with our basic systems version five. To get started, we click open home and we want to pick a program that we actually want to run through the F122. In this case, I'll pick acid reflux one. Simply click the run button and notice what happens on the F122. So we've set the F122 program acid reflux to the generator, it's actually running. There's a countdown going on in the software as well, but you'll notice here, the uh, bulb is lit, and you'll notice as well, the right LED will be lit as well while the program is running. In this case, the LED is pulsing. Once again, other programs, that light may be unsteady.